on November 12th, the GE Honda Aero joint venture, which began in 2004, marked a milestone in its evolution, with the unveiling of the first production HF120 turbofan engine to come off the assembly line at the Honda Aero headquarters in Burlington, North Carolina. Well, it's very, very exciting. It's been 12 years since we started talking together, Honda and GE, to explore an opportunity for us to go into business in this market segment. Honda had done a lot of research on turbojet engines like this, uh, and being the number one engine manufacturer in the world, we have a tremendous amount of experience in the industry. We were looking for a partner to get into this segment, and Honda was looking for a way to commercialize the work and research that they had already done. All previous test examples, along with the first 10 production units of the 2,095 pound thrust engine, which powers the soon to be certified Honda jet, were built at GE's plant in Lynn, Massachusetts. To note the occasion, company executives, along with state and local officials led by North Carolina Governor Pat McCrory, gathered at the Honda Aero facility, which opened in 2008. We want you to succeed, we want you to make money, and we are also so appreciative of you returning your investments back to this community and creating jobs. So uh, both to Honda and to GE, I want to say thank you. The Wright brothers are smiling right now and saying aviation is still the place to go for new innovation and for talent. This first Burlington-built engine is one of four scheduled to be shipped to the Honda jet plant 22 miles away in Greensboro before the end of November, with another two to follow in December. Until it receives its FAA production certificate expected early next year, the engines produced in Burlington will each be certified by an FAA-designated airworthiness representative. In the coming months, when Honda Air receive production certification from the FAA, it will be the first time in over 20 years for a company to obtain a new engine production certification in the United States. The Honda Jet itself is anticipated to receive its type certification from the FAA in the first quarter of 2015. And according to Izumi, once that is awarded, Honda Aero will produce 100 HF120 engines over the next year, enough to equip 50 of the light jets. The Burlington facility will also serve as the worldwide location for maintenance, repair, and overhaul of the new engine, which is expected to be the first in a line of business aviation power plants from the joint venture manufacturer. For AIN-TV, I'm Kurt Epstein.